Xbox's online servers are down today, July 2nd, with some people reporting that they are having difficulty connecting to games and services on the platform. After initially making no mention of it, the official Xbox server status website sign-in services are having a major outage. With a server network as large as Xbox's, your mileage may vary, but many players are unable to log in. Microsoft's own game accounts have acknowledged the server troubles. We apologize for the inconvenience, Microsoft said. The Xbox support account said Microsoft is aware that some users have been disconnected from Xbox Live. The company said it is investigating the matter. Just after 1 p.m. Pacific Time, 4 p.m. Eastern Time, it provided an update in which it said the investigation is taking longer than expected. There's no word on when Xbox Live servers will be back online. The Xbox network, formerly known as Xbox Live, experiences server hiccups and other connectivity issues on a semi-regular basis. However, this latest downtime was significant enough to trigger fans to take to social media to complain and express frustration. The Call of Duty fan account Charlie Intel reported that Call of Duty servers were among those affected by the issues today. Microsoft will no doubt hope to fix the issues quickly, as the Xbox network is sure to be flooded with users in the coming days for the 4th of July weekend. GameSpot will update this story as the server situation evolves, so keep checking back for the latest. Xbox users have spent the last several hours cut off from the platform's online features following a major outage. Microsoft confirmed the issues were widespread across Xbox Series X slash S accounts, but said its investigation into the source of the downtime was taking longer than expected. We are aware that some users have been disconnected from Xbox Live. The company's Xbox support account tweeted on Tuesday as players began posting about the outage across social media and Reddit. We're investigating the company shared at 4.08 p.m. Eastern Time. That was followed by another update at 5.49 p.m. Eastern Time. Investigation continues into issues impacting users' ability to sign in to Xbox Live and services, Microsoft tweeted. Thank you for your patience while our engineers work. According to the company's status page, the problems are isolated to Xbox accounts and profiles. You may not be able to sign in to your Xbox profile, may be disconnected while signed in, or have other related problems, the description reads. Features that require sign-in like most games, apps, and social activity won't be available. What that means Xbox owners are unable to play online games like Fortnite, Halo Infinite, and Diablo 4. It also means that some users are facing error messages even when they try to log into their Xbox profiles to play single-player games. One Twitter user going by the handle nitpictum ran into problems trying to play Persona 5 Royal. Fine example why always online bullshit is dangerous, they wrote in a tweet that quickly went viral. I cannot play a disc-based single-player game? As many quickly pointed out, however, the workaround for this particular error simply requires players go into their settings and put the console in offline mode. In Nitpictim's case, pulling out the Ethernet cable also worked. I had a similar problem and was able to sign back into my profile and access offline games again simply by manually restarting my console. Offline Game Pass games are also unaffected. They remain accessible for up to 30 days in between reconnecting to the internet. While service interruptions aren't unheard of, it's rare for entire network features to be down for so many players for such a long period of time. And unlike online services for PC gaming, Microsoft charges Xbox users $10 a month in order to access multiplayer features on their consoles. Hopefully the outage gets resolved quickly.